Virgo, welcome to your general reading. This is a general and will not resonate with everybody, unfortunately. But I do do personal readings and my email is in the description box. Thank you guys for all the likes and shares and subscriptions. It really means a lot to me. Thank you guys. So we're going to pull some messages from your angels first. Virgo. Adriana. I am leading you towards the answer to your prayers. Please listen to follow and sorry, please listen to and follow the steps I am communicating through your intuition, thoughts and dreams. So you could be receiving messages in your dreams there, Virgo. Could be dreaming about somebody or past or your childhood here or something. Let's see what the energy is for Virgo. The Emperor. Some stubborn energy there. <laughs> Oops. Ooh, the Fool. And the Two of Swords. So, um, indecisive. Somebody very stubborn about um, a new beginning. Um, so, even if it's, you know, um, you're unclear if you want to... Um, meet somebody new again even here you're unsure about the decision or somebody it could be a soulmate if you're watching in regards to a soulmate you already know here um they're not giving you any answers and being quite stubborn about a new beginning here so it's like um Either they're being indecisive or you don't have all the information you seek to make a decision yet. I feel like possibly you want a new beginning here and they're just not giving you an answer. It's like they've taken the choice out of your hands. Ooh, three of wands. So yeah. Waiting, working on yourself while waiting here, I feel. Very positive, that. Very positive. Working on yourself while you are waiting on your ships coming in. Working very hard. So getting now good money coming in. Very good. Could have um, a very stubborn boss that's making you work um, over time. But don't worry, in the end here, it's going to pay off. You may not be able to see it yet, but it is going to. Five of pentacles. So yeah, if money is very tight at the moment, um, don't worry. It's coming there with the three of wands. That's your ships coming in. What are these cards doing, Virgo? So the five of pentacles here. So yeah, it could be a struggle with money or it could be um, just feeling that lack of love or attention from somebody here um and if it is um feelings love or attention um i feel like it, things will turn around here so don't worry about that it's like you can't see it coming just yet but there's something coming a new beginning something here um coming with the fool it's like you just have to trust Maybe with this um, full card here and this three of wands and two of swords, it's like maybe you can feel them coming, but you can't actually see them coming as she's blindfolded here. It's like you can't see them in your physical world right now, but you just sort of feel, you know, they're coming. So you're waiting for this new beginning here. You're taking a chance and waiting. I feel like um, the person has very strong energy on, you know, they've made their choice sort of thing, but it sort of left you up in the air. So I do believe, you know, while you've been waiting, you've been working on yourself. So that's very positive. Um, just remember, if you're still feeling um, that absence or any lack try and turn that around into positivity into like certainty um like oh, i believe you know um somebody's coming or i believe things are getting better here 
and that'll help the energy turn around here the angels are saying you know i am leading you listen to your intuition here yeah okay maybe you can't see it yet but it's coming with the three of wands so listen and trust that it's coming don't let any doubt creep in with this five of pentacles you know you've been working very hard with the eight of pentacles to um, per perfect your craft here or um, you know look at yourself and work on yourself here so you know i feel like you're going on blind faith but you just know it's coming it's like that um high priestess feeling that inner knowing queen of wands yeah somebody definitely taking action towards you here could be a fire sign doesn't have to be um but strong indication of aries and sagittarius here very strong indication of Aries. They could be the ones working on themselves as well here. While, you know, um, it's like they may appear like they're being stubborn or ignorant here in this emperor mode, but they could also be working quite a lot and um, working on themselves as well. So with this two of swords, it's definitely telling me that you don't have all the information, but this three of wands is letting me know you feel that something is coming. Someone is coming or something is coming here. I don't know why all these cards keep wanting to jump for you guys. Let me take a look then. So we have seven of swords, eight of cups, the hanged man, the two of pentacles, the chariot, ace of wands and knight of wands. Um, Somebody could have um, been tempted away here. So if you are waiting on a person to come back, um, communication will be coming in. Um, just be careful on that communication, though, if this is somebody who left you because of cheating. Um, you know, make sure you make the correct decision there with the two of pentacles get all the information first doesn't have to be um with this read on the table that it's somebody um you already know this could be um a job offer coming into your life a promotion here you just feel it for you it'll resonate with you so either it's a person or it's a job offer if things have been tight and you're like I know I have to keep pushing through these difficult times because I know it's going to get better. I've just got this feeling in my soul here. Eight of Swords. So, um, you know, feeling stuck. I did a video about feeling stuck, if you are. So, um, yeah, you could look that up if you wanted to. Um, but this lets you know it's only in your mind that you are stuck. There's a way out, I feel, but you just don't see it yet. Or you're overthinking and starting to worry um, or doubt here with the five of pentacles. But trust your instinct. Trust your gut. That's the message from your angels here. Knight of pentacles, yeah. So if you was waiting for somebody... They took a hell of a long time. Or if you're cross-watching for a Virgo, this would be the Virgo taking a long time. And this is what's making you overthink and feel this doubt and lack. Trust that they will come. You know, your intuition being led in the right direction here. Seven of Pentacles, yeah. You have been waiting a long time for this person. It probably feels like a very, very long time to you. Um, this lets me know that while you was previously waiting, um, you wasn't getting any signs from them. So this would be a person who wasn't talking to you, not communicating with you, keeping you in the dark about what's going on with them. So this is somebody who's not feeding any energy into... Um, the situation here. 
if that resonates with you. And this could be why doubt is creeping in, whether they're coming or not. Whether you're waiting in vain or not here. If your gut tells you that they're coming, they're coming. You don't have to see them. You know, your angels are trying to tell you, look, you'll either be getting signs or something like that. Okay, guys, if, if this is for you, somebody wants to come in and start a new beginning here. Okay, good luck. <laughs>